Pseudomonas is a bacteria. Uh, it's a bacteria that is often seen in patients with cystic fibrosis. We know that by adulthood, about 80% of patients with CF will develop pseudomonas infection that will be persistent. One of the key things in treating lung infection, especially in patients with pseudomonas, is that uh, at some point, the majority of patients with cystic fibrosis develop persistent infection with pseudomonas. And in that condition, you have to use a variety of antibiotics, but you can't use the same antibiotic over a period of time because that exerts a tremendous pressure on the lung, and those organisms will undergo mutation and evolve and become resistant to antibiotics that they see over and over and over again. Castin is the newest inhaled antibiotic that's been approved by the FDA and specifically targeted for treatment of pseudomonas in patients with cystic fibrosis. The reason that Castin has such an important role in the treatment of pseudomonas currently is that in the past we've either had IV antibiotics, one inhaled antibiotic, uh, and this gives us a second inhaled antibiotic to use that expands our options for patients, some of whom don't respond as well uh, or may not tolerate the existing uh, inhaled tobramycin. It also is, I think, far better to be able to use inhaled antibiotics since we know that the infection we're treating is on the airway surface. And unlike people who have typical pneumonia where we treat with IV antibiotics, um, we have the benefit of being able to get a lot of antibiotic into the airways to treat the infection and really hit the bacteria very, very hard without causing a lot of toxicity to the kidneys, to hearing, or other side effects that we commonly associate with antibiotics. Casein's delivered through an electronic nebulizer, which is uh, small, battery-powered, silent, and extremely efficient. It delivers a dose that is probably four to five times as um, efficient as our existing jet nebulizers that most people are familiar with that they use with other therapies. Uh, it really is wonderful because it delivers a dose uh, in two to three minutes as opposed to 15 minutes, uh, uh, which is common for some of the other medications that people take. And saving time for uh, patients with CF is really important given how many things we are already asking them to do uh, in a day's time. Recently, I've heard that about 4,000 patients with cystic fibrosis are currently using Casein, uh, so there's been rapid and pretty broad acceptance, and it really is a medication that is targeted for patients with CF who have persistent pseudomonas infection, where they may have already been using something to suppress the growth of pseudomonas, uh, or it's time for them to start that type of therapy because over the years we've seen that it really has had a benefit in uh, preserving lung function.